Leslie Meredith with Breakbulk Events and Media. I am here in Breakbulk Studios with Carl Lander, uh, the founder. Is the founder? No, not the founder. Oh, just one of the early okay. one of the early employees. Okay, love that. Um, Carl's with a startup called Armok Rob Robotics, which is really exciting. So, tell us about the company and what your goals are. Yeah, so Armok Robotics, oh, thank you for having me here, Leslie. It's great to be here talking about what we're doing at Armok. Uh, so yeah, Armok is a startup company formed last year as an outgrowth from another company in the in the subsea market called Green Sea Systems. Green Sea has been working in software across the industry for a number of years and saw this need to automate robots for ship cleaning. Um, fouling on ships is a huge contributor to greenhouse gas emissions, global climate change issues. It's also a, a major uh, vector for transporting invasive species around the globe. So keeping your hulls clean is important. We're setting out to really take a different approach to it, revolutionize how it's done through a proactive model vice the traditional reactive approaches that industry has been using for hundreds of years. Oh, interesting. So you say proactive. In this case, what does that mean? So in terms of ship cleaning, what that means is being on the ship routinely when it's only micro fouling, slime, the algae that starts to grow, maybe it gets a little bit of green, a little bit of brown. Don't let it get to grasses and barnacles. Uh, so we want to be on there yeah, right as it starts to grow, just at the point that there's something to clean, but not letting it get to any greater degree where it's really starting to impact ship performance or be potentially harmful to the environment, either through the growth or through the cleaning process itself. Interesting. So there sounds like there's some significant benefits to being proactive rather than reactive, as you put it. Yes, there are. There's a couple benefits to it. A recent uh, study by the International Maritime Organization showed that slime alone can contribute anywhere from 10 to 20 percent in increased greenhouse gas emissions from the shipping fleet. And so if we can clean it routinely and never let that, that build up, we, we see a significant fuel savings to the vessel operators, burn less fuel, less emissions. And the, the algae, if we pull that off gently using soft brushes, we're not damaging the coating, we're not polluting, and we're not risking the transport of invasive species from port to port. Perfect, I love that. So tell me, why are you here at Break Bulk Americas? Uh, we're here at Break Bulk Americas. We saw the uh, the opportunity to present a, a new solution to aiding in decarbonization of the of the shipping industry. There's a, a wide number of, of ship operators, ship owners here at Break Bulk Americas. And while the focus is is a lot on cargo, the entire evolution of moving cargo from port to port needs to be decarbonized. And we see our solution as being a key component of that and this is a great opportunity to to meet with a number of, of shipping operators that I don't think we'd see anyplace else. Uh, well great. Well I wish you the best of luck. This is a very exciting company service fits so well with sustainability goals now. Um, so we will be watching you. We love it. Excellent. Thank you for the opportunity to be here Leslie. Absolutely.